Za samo nekoliko dana u Crvenoj zvezdi pokazao je raskušan talent. Do sada je postigao nekoliko golova, iako sezona još uvek nije nastavljena. Da li se tako dobro snalazi i u malom futbalu, imat ćemo priliku da saznamo upravo u emisiji Nema roštiljanja jer je naš gost Ohi. First of all, welcome. Thank you. How well did you get with this table? Very good. I played a lot when I was young. I didn't want to know that, but here it is, so we have to try it, right? Yeah. Who will win? No doubt. If you win, it's because I let you. <laughs> Everybody say that, but okay, let's start with that. Ready? Of course. First of all, now it's pressure on me because you say you're really good with this. I'm not. Uh, so can you tell me, how does your childhood look like? You played, as you said, a lot of this kind of games. Yes, we had, um, we had a place where we could go to after school. Mm -hmm. And they had a lot of uh, games and they had FIFA, they had, uh, we can play basketball or we can play indoor football. So we can, yeah. we can play a lot of their yeah, pool and everything. So I used to go there uh, after every, uh, after, after school, uh, almost every day and we got food and everything. So it's really nice. As I get, you played a lot, so I can score a goal here, right? Right. Yeah, yeah. It'll be difficult to, no, you can, you can, you can. So, uh, yeah. So these are nice memories you spend time with your friends, right? Yeah, yeah very nice. Uh, it was a place you could you could uh, meet other people you knew. Other people were there all the time, and you can just you didn't need to like uh, plan call. it with anybody <laughs> or call anybody. You knew mm -hmm. that uh, you knew that people were there all the time. Mm -hmm. So um, so yeah, it's a nice it's a nice memory. It's uh, I had a good good childhood. Oi, scored again. Which one is mine? This. So, yeah, yeah, you can take this one. Okay, good. So, uh, you had a really nice childhood, right? With your friends, spending time? Yes. Did you always win in the games when you were playing? Or did you know how to lose when you were young? It's too too? Uh, no, I was a really bad... I still am t <laughs> to some extent. But I'm, of course, I've grown a lot. But I was a bad loser when I was younger. <laughs> I didn't like to lose. but. What I think were you doing when that happened? Uh, no, I just got really angry. I could scream and, and stuff. But uh, it's because it's the it's kind of the environment I was raised in. Yeah. All my friends were like this. No, nobody liked to lose. So uh, I just get affected mm -hmm. by, by the environment. So, uh, so I'm much better at handling losing now, but I still don't like it. But uh, I know that it can happen. You can't... Uh, you have to take it sometimes. It's, Impossible to win. <laughs> it's impossible to win all the time. Okay. So, uh, what was the thing that you liked to do the most when you were young? Uh, that was Except playing playing football for sure. Yeah. Yes, I played, but I didn't only play football. I also played uh, indoor hockey. Yeah, so, that sounds interesting. Yeah, so I played I played a lot of sports to to get busy. Uh, so. Um, so yeah, I did a lot of stuff and I bought yeah. football was always always the the most fun to do and all my friends played it as well. So come on, this was stupid goal. Uh, so how did you decide that you like to, to train football? Did you watch it? Did you play it on the street like like it's uh, common in Serbia for example or everywhere? Right? Uh, yeah, we had uh, like a small place with fences where we played five against five. So uh, so it's it was really fun, and uh, but I didn't decide to to like really go in for it before I was uh, before I was like 13 years old, 12, 13 years old. Uh, it was after I watched the game with my friend. Uh, we watched Arsenal uh, play, and, uh, and there was a striker there, Thierry Henry, and uh, I think he scored like two or three goals. And uh, it was a really fun game to watch. And after that, I. I, I was a, I became an Arsenal fan and I also became like a football fan and uh, and all after that I wanted to to like do the same and, and score goals and, and, and play football and uh, and play on the TV so after this that was that was like it then I started to play for real like serious not only for fun but I played to try to become something and not only for fun so you wasn't that young when you decided that you'll be uh, a football player? No, I wasn't that young. I was not. So mm -hmm. I was uh, old, if you can say, because most people say to me, ah, we started playing when we were seven, eight, or even six. 
But when I was this age, I didn't even like football. I didn't watch football. I didn't play football at this age. I think I started on my first team when I was 12 or 13. So you see, it's it's possible even though you're late. You don't need to. You, like everybody fall in love with the game at different times. You, it, it doesn't. You don't. You don't need to do it at six or or decide at a young age. You can decide whenever you want. It's it's never too late. So. Maybe I, it's not too late for me to win sometimes. Here, yeah, right? you can still win. Yeah. It's uh, it's possible. Yeah, we'll I'm see. not so much ahead of you now. So, <laughs> so um, when you when you were young, uh, so you didn't want, like, as you said, you didn't want to become a football player when you were I don't know six seven years old. So what was your dreams back then? Uh, <laughs> I wanted to be. Uh, I wanted to do like triathlon uh, <laughs> yeah. and and stuff like that. Like. Uh, you know the running, the hundred yeah, yeah. meters, and uh, jumping the, the yeah, yeah the thing and everything. That's what I wanted to do. To uh, to to be in the Olympic yeah. and do this stuff. <laughs> so that's actually what I wanted to do. So, uh, but uh, I don't think I was fast enough to do this uh, <laughs> to do these things. But uh, I'm happy that I chose um, that I chose uh, football. Because yeah. uh, it's it's really fun to play and I, I, I enjoy every moment. So maybe you're why are you looking at the result? <laughs> Just see if I need to take it a little bit easier on you. Know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> did your parents uh, support you when you were young, and what was their dream for you? How much did they help you with that? Yeah, they support me every every time. Uh, there was no no problem, you know. I. Uh, uh, they have always been supportive and told me that uh, you can. Nothing happened. You, didn't, you, didn't <laughs> you can uh, you can do whatever you want, whatever makes you happy, you can do it. And of course, they try to push me to do what they think is right. And, um, and my dad also he played football, uh, but because of his back and his uh, knees, he couldn't. Uh, he didn't go too far. But he was a good football player as well, and uh, he too loves football and watches every game I play, and he watches every game in Premier League and La Liga and everything. So, so I come from a football family. My brothers also played uh, played football. So, uh, so yeah, the, my parents always been supportive, supportive, and uh, and that's why also the first salary I did what I did and bought my mom uh, the ring she wanted. She wanted the ring, and I said yes, I buy this for you as a gift. So. That was a proud moment for me, and I didn't make much at that time. But uh, but still, to to manage to do something for for especially my mom, it was it was a big moment for me. And now you get better and better by the time. Do you have any advices, maybe now, from your uh, parents, from your brothers, or when they watch your games? If they give me advice, yeah. <laughs> Today, when they see you in the field, they make they are oh, good, 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 good. They just uh, tell tells me uh, that I, I should keep having fun and uh, and and uh, remember that uh, not everybody is as fortunate as us football players. You know, yeah. uh, we we make money on doing something we love. You know, it's it's no struggle to go to training every day. It's it's fun to go to training. You know, yeah. and. Uh, and we can make money on this also, so we we are really privileged to, to do so. so. So they tell me that I always have to remember this and always be be grateful and, and, and don't think about pressure or anything, just uh, have fun on the field because uh, that's why you do this. You do this because it's fun. Uh, it doesn't feel like work, It's it's for me it's, it's enjoyment, so they make sure that I always remember this. I don't think we have much time left until you win, so I have to ask you, what is your favorite childhood uh, memory? My favorite childhood memory? Hmm. Good question. I have a lot of childhood memories. Um, but uh, the thing I remember right now is uh, when, my, uh, when my parents bought me my first football shoes yeah. and uh, how happy I was and uh, because my parents are really hard working and like we we have never been rich you know my dad came from uh, africa uh, as a student to norway and didn't have much and my mom also grew up came from a family who didn't have a lot of money so they worked all day and it was times we didn't see them a lot because they were always at work so when they spent this money uh, to to buy football shoes for me it was uh, 
it was big. I remember how happy I was when when they came home with these shoes, and uh, and I remember it, remember it till this day. So, uh, so yeah, it's a it's it's a good it's a good memory. You had great childhood uh, memories, and you got a great advice. Uh, I'm happy that uh, all the fans of Red Star can uh, hear it from you. So uh, thank you so much. I will congratulate you for this victory. Should I let you win? That was stupid. Congratulations. Anyway. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>